So because I have nothing else better to do with my life, I decided to build a pyramid farm because me suffering equals entertainment for you guys. Also, you should subscribe because it's scientifically proven that your life will get better. You also get a big cock. So the first thing I did was spawn, look at my map, then go for the spawn chest. Yes, I turned it on because I'm too lazy to actually get the stuff. Anyways, here's the plan. I have to try to find a flat area, and once I find the flat area, I will collect the dirt to make the area fully flat. And with that dirt, I will construct the pyramid. And then, make a farm. And that's it, I'm done. Just one problem. I don't know what to put inside the pyramid. I was thinking a city, but I don't think I want to build a city after making a damn pyramid. With the farm, and no water, which is a pain, cause just one step and that planted crop will go back to dirt. Anyways, I started looking around and I'm so glad that I didn't have to travel far because I found the perfect place to near spawn. Alright, now it's time to mine everything. But first, I need shovels. I'm kinda hoping I have enough shovels. I, you know, I just made a couple. Just, you know, just a couple. Hopefully, that will mine all the dirt. All my shovels have gone extinct. But I did it. I'm sorry I didn't show you me mining all the dirt. I'm recording with my ancient PlayStation 4 that is on the verge of exploding and has very limited space. Just buy an extra storage- NO! Because I'm broke and my PlayStation is just fine. The fan is silent as a mice. Anyways, I mined everything. Now I have to build it. So what I did was build a base for the pyramid and build it up from all four sides to make it one block at the top. I also have a couple of dirt, you know, just a little. Hopefully this is enough to build the pyramid. You know, I'm building a skeleton for the pyramid. I don't know why, when I could just start building from the bottom to the top. Okay, before I continue with the video, I just want to say something. While I was looking through my footage, I noticed that I kept skipping parts, like the part where I built the whole pyramid. And I'm very sorry, I didn't record it. Just like I said, my PlayStation is low on storage, and I didn't want to record much. And I don't want you guys to think I'm cheating. So, at the end of the video, I will open my settings and show you it has not been set to creative. Anyways, let's just continue with the video. Okay, so I didn't have enough blocks. So I went somewhere to mine the dirt, and I have some left over. And as you can see, I finished it. It took days, but I did it. Now it's time to craft a millions of hoes and use it, and then plant wheat. By the way, I added a nice entrance, and here's the inside of the pyramid. Very dark and empty, but I'm gonna build something. Okay, this took quite a while, but I did it. If we go inside the pyramid, I added a nice little cobblestone path, added lots of torches in the inside, and also put a room at the top of the pyramid, and made water falling down, cause waterfalls are cool. And in this room, you could see that I built a mini farm. This room has no purpose other than growing wheat. By the way, the skeleton horse army thing spawned and almost died trying to kill all the skeleton. Buy one, and now I have an enchanted bow and a skeleton horse friend. As you can see, I started with the farm, and I was gonna use wheat, but it takes long to grow, and when I mine it, the chances of me getting a lot of seeds back are very low. So I decided to go with carrots because carrots grow fast, and when I mine it, it gives me a lot of carrots back. So this is officially a carrot pyramid farm. But before I continue, this is bothering me. When I was building the pyramid, I realized that I had to be a little bit more bigger, so I built out, and now this exists. So what I'm gonna do is add a floor and add glass. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. Of course, this world doesn't have any beaches, so I had to get some sand from these tiny sand piles on the side of the mountains. I added a floor, but the sand now has to cook, so in the meanwhile, let me continue with the pyramid. Here's a time lapse that's actually 5 minutes in real time. Okay, so the sand is done cooking and I placed it all, but this is as much as I could fill in. By the way, here's the progress of the pyramid. 
the front is almost done. Finally, I found a beach not too far. It's been days that I've been working on this pyramid. Half of it's because I get on this world knowing it's not near done, then I get lazy, then I get off. But now it's almost done. And as you can see, I finished two sides. Now all I need is two more sides. <laughs> it's almost done. I did the back and the side. I just need one more little section and then I'm done. Again, I apologize for not recording, but hey, it helps me edit this video faster and get this video out before 2023. I am so close to finishing this project and I would like to share this moment with you guys. And I am done. I'm officially done. I am so happy that. Okay, yeah, there are some imperfections, but those don't matter because I'm done. Look at the inside. Very beautiful. By the way, in this room, there used to be wheat growing, but I replaced it with carrots. And this glass room, it's not done, but I have come to the, real the realization that this room has no purpose. I just look out into the lake and that's it. So this room is going to be empty for now, I guess. And that's basically it. I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. I am so sorry that I didn't record some parts, but hey, that helped me because I can edit this video faster. And I want to get this video out before the new year because I wanted to say thank you guys for 351 subscribers. Even though half of you guys don't even watch me, I still want to say thank you. Because when you subscribe, I get very happy and it makes my day every time I see those notifications. By the way, I might continue this video. I don't know. We'll see. And also, if you thought I was doing this the whole time when I made this video... Then you're wrong, because i actually been listening to music every time I worked on this video. And before the video ends, here's your proof that I didn't cheat. Boom, as you can see, this is the world. This is the world right here, look. As you can see, I'm going over here. I'm going to go on top of the pyramid, okay? No cuts, no nothing. I'm just letting this roll. <clears throat> So how was your guys' day? Pretty good? Yeah, you know, mine was good. I just left this wheat here because, uh, you know, a uh, new, uh, new video coming soon. You'll see. Uh, as you can see, look, boom, I'm on top of the pyramid. Boom. Okay, now let me open my settings. Boom. Look, now, if I want to set it to creative, look, as you can see, if I want to set it to creative, this message pops up. Now, some of you guys probably know that you only get this message if it's your first time setting the world to creative. If I have set it to creative and then put it back to survival and then wanting to put it back to creative, I would not get this message. As you can see, so this proves that I did not cheat. This is all survival. Yeah. D -d Boom. Oh, the frick. My control. Boom, there. You've been proven wrong, cause... Yeah. <laughs>